Scott Oaks with 1851 Franchise here at the Franchise Expo South in Dallas. We are talking with Jen Cheney of Scooters Coffee. So Jen, tell us a little bit about Scooters. Uh, we're a drive through coffee concept. Uh, we started in 1998. Uh, right now we have a little over 160 locations open and operating in 15 states. All right. Excellent. So what is it about scooters that is uh, a little bit different for uh, for your customers? Yep. So we really focus on the drive through part of the business. Our drive through coffee kiosk is our most popular business model. And what sets us apart from our competition are, is our brand promise. So it's amazing people serving amazing drinks amazingly fast. Okay. And for, for the business opportunity, for the folks that are looking at obviously lots of different concepts here, um, what do you think is a big differentiator for, for scooters or a few differentiators for scooters? Um, well, I think one would be is that we're, we're a rapidly growing franchise and it's a unique concept with a drive-through part of the business. It's a completely freestanding building that's drive-through only in this day and age. People People rely on convenience and that's what we're all about but coupled with great speed of service and a quality product on top of that. All right, excellent. So from a expansion standpoint, obviously you've got lots of room to grow. Are there any specific markets that you're looking to uh, focus your growth on? Yes, so uh, specifically here in Dallas uh, at this show, we are, uh, we've got an area representative who is has the ability to own and operate 40 locations, but he doesn't want to do that. He's going to be selling some of those locations. So we're really pushing for this Dallas market and we're actively pursuing franchise owners right here in Dallas. And and overall from your standpoint, what do you think makes a, a good Scooters Coffee owner? Is there any type of background, uh, type of experience that you're looking for? Really most importantly, it, what you need to have is the, the willingness to learn because we realize that if you don't have coffee experience or food service experience or even business ownership experience, that's okay. What you have to have is that ability and the willingness to learn.